possession of the truth. Yes? So you're saying the purpose of arguing your point is to find the truth. Right. If you're constantly looking for evidence to support your argument, how do you find the truth? It's not easy. That's philosophy. It's just a matter of looking for more evidence. If I don't prove it on Monday, I take a rest and I go back to the drawing board, so to speak, on Tuesday. That's just philosophy. I look for more evidence for my view. I don't give up, though, and say, well, it's just my truth. You know, by the way, if I did think that, I wouldn't even seek evidence. What's the point in trying to prove it to someone else? That's just like saying the textbook is a truth, but the textbook might not be the truth. Like, the textbook of political science might be a truth, but it does not mean that the political activists know it's the truth. So I might as well just accept what's in the book, because I'm never going to find the truth, because there's no such thing. Right. I might as well just accept what's convenient, right? I should never criticize my own culture, right, because I have to live within that culture, and its truth is as good as any other truth's, right? Yep. So there's really no point in seeking evidence. The truth is like the tolerance. There's no point in trying to justify something. Its own existence within the culture justifies it, yeah. The truth can even go as far as it sounds true. Right. 